uh, from the government side that is under the keyword of safety of the family and human life. So when we talk about safety, just because you're in a family, it doesn't mean you can hit anyone, you can kick anyone, you can punch anyone in a family. Because if you do, you're actually abiding the foundation itself. Why? Because in a family, you need love and respect and understanding itself. So that is what we say by actually uh, hitting or... Yes, you might play around with your kids by actually punching their in the face. But when it comes to severe case, then we refer. So when we, force this, uh, when we actually making the doctors, when we force the doctors by making it a law, so when the doctors do come across with this kind of situation, as I stated earlier, the, the victim itself might come to the doctor because they have severe pains and the doctor can detect what is actually happening to them. Then we will tell the authorities. For example, if the doctor might actually know what is caused of the severe pains by the private parts, might actually it was caused by the abuse done by the separate itself. So then we will tell the authorities. Why do we need the so when the artists know, uh, uh, when the artists know that why do we want to tell the objective at the first place? It's because we don't want the victim to be abused continuously. We don't want the victim to be, uh, to be uh, and the criminal actually, to be running away freely. Because that is why we want the authorities to take actions so that we can actually put, we can actually put a full stop on what is going on. So that is why we say, uh, this one's actually in Dutch by how we say that it, it actually turns to the safety of the family itself. No for your eyes? I guess not. So, but basically, when we talk about safety, we are showing to them that why exactly in our case we are making it a law. Because most people, they want it to be a secret. They, want to, uh, they don't want the doctors to know anything about them. Why? Because they are scared. This is not right. When we say that this is not right, simply because when the doctors do know, then no action will be taken out. When no action will be taken out, so further investigation will not be done. So that is why we want the doctors to actually tell the authorities what is going on so that so that they can actually put a stop to it. No clear your eyes? I guess not. And when we talk about human's life, when I talk about human's life, it actually means when the criminals go around, yes, when we talk about domestic suspect, uh, when we talk about domestic violent cases, it actually involves at home. But then when we talk about this, um, the, uh, where the criminals run around freely, they are not just actually uh, cause um, dangers to the person at home, they might actually cause something else to the outer part of the world itself. And that is why we are making it a stop. Because how to make it a stop by telling the authorities, obviously. So that is why we say this, uh, this one should stand. So before I take my seat, I would like to reaffirm our stand that this house forced doctors to divulge information regarding suspected domestic violence, violence cases simply because it has many benefits. I repeat, this house would enforce, uh, this house would force doctors to divulge information regarding suspected domestic violence cases simply because it has many benefits. With that, I proudly propose. Thank you.